Thank you and good morning, everyone. When we gather around treaty lands, our Catholic social teachings call us in solidarity with our indigenous brothers and sisters to honor and respect the four directions, lands, waters, plants, animals, and ancestors that have walked before us. We want to acknowledge the traditional territory of the Anishinaabek Nation, the people of the three fires, known as Ojibwe, Ottawa, and Potawatomi nations. We acknowledge the rich historical and modern traditions of the many First Nations and Métis people. We further give thanks to the Chippewas of Saugeen and the Chippewas of Nawash, now known as the Saugeen Ojibwe Nation, as the traditional keepers of this land. I'll now pass it on to our chaplain, Mrs. Legacy, for today's prayer. Good morning, Sacred Heart. Today is Wednesday, June 23rd. Today's reading is from the book of Galatians. There is no longer Jew or Greek. There is no longer slave or free. There is no longer male and female. For all of you are one in Christ Jesus. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Sometimes hanging out with others who have similar likes can be a good thing, as long as it does not become a means for excluding or demeaning others. The letter to the Galatians reminds us that we are all one in Christ and the destructive barriers that exist should be removed. Eliminating those barriers as, is at the heart of what it means to live in solidarity with our brothers and sisters. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord Jesus, you called us to be as one. Help us work toward that goal. Amen. Sacred Heart, have mercy on us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. It's your birthday today.